Prime Minister Ismail Sabri Yaakob has directed that former Attorney General Tommy Thomas be immediately investigated for sedition and several other offences arising from the contents of his controversial memoirs. An official statement issued by the Prime Minister's office said that Thomas will be probed under Section 8 of the Official Secrets Act, Section 23 of the Malaysian Anti-Corruption Commission Act, and Sections 1241 and 203A of the Penal Code. Ismail said a special task force formed to look into allegations in Thomas's book had initially identified 19 issues. These issues were then narrowed down into four main issues, namely allegations against the judiciary, exposing government secrets, abuse of power and professional negligence, as well as seditious statements. In a statement, Ismail said the special task force, which presented its findings at a cabinet meeting earlier today, had detailed every allegation made by Thomas in his book. Section 4 of the Sedition Act provides for a maximum jail term of three years or a 5,000 ringgit fine or both, while Section 23 of the MACC Act deals with abuse of power, providing up to 20 years in prison and a fine not less than five times the value of the bribe. Section 203A of the Penal Code involves disclosure of information obtained in the performance of one's duty, which provides for up to one year in prison, a maximum 1 million ringgit fine or both. Section 8 of the OSA involves wrongful communication of an official secret, providing for a jail sentence of between 1 to 7 years. Thomas's book, titled My Story, Justice in the Wilderness, was published in January last year.